Hello, my name is Jamie, and this is your Matthew Movers speaking test. Can you tell me what is your name? My name is Lamar. And how old are you? I'm nine years old. Good. In your speaking test, we will have three parts. Part one, you will find the differences between two photos. Part two, you will tell a story from pictures. And part three, you will spot the other one out. So, part one, can you tell me the differences in these pictures using full sentences? In picture one, there is a black cat. In picture two, there is a yellow cat. Good. In picture one, the poster is this football. Good. In picture two, the poster is tennis. Yeah. In picture one, the boy is listening to music. In picture two, the boy is reading a book. Mm -hmm. In picture one, there is a camera on the table. In picture two, the camera is under the table. And there is one more. What about, what is the boy wearing? In picture one, the boy is wearing a red shirt. In picture two, the boy is wearing green shirt. Good, that was very good. So that's the end of part one. So on to part two, we've got these four pictures. So the name of this story is Eight New Hats, and this is Zoe. So can you tell me this story? Zoe is going to the market and buy, buy a new hat. She, she goes to the park and she is tired. She, she is sleek and the bird is eating some food on her hat. Zoe is, is get, getting up. She is angry with the bird. Good, well done, that's very good. Okay, now part three for the last section is spot the odd one out. So let's start with the first row. Which is the odd one out? A bear. Good. Why is the bed the odd one out? Because it's, it isn't in the bathroom. Good. And how about the second row? Which is the odd one out? A shark. Because a lion, a dog, and a bear, they, they have four legs. Good. And this one, the third row? Picture three. Yeah. And why is he the other one? Because the boy is happy. Okay. And the last one, so which is the other one out here? A sandwich. Because three pictures is for drink. Yeah, and what is the sandwich? It's, it's for it. Good. Well done.